This video is now brought to you by GeekWithTree.com What's up people, Dobbs is right here and welcome to a Pokemon pack opening, yes, for March. Before we start of course, please check out GeekWithTree.com, they are amazing as you guys know. And today, let me get out these beautiful yellow sleeves on the other side. Today, we're opening up the new set. Probably it's not a new set for you guys now because you guys are watching these other countless times, but it is for me because it's being pre recorded. Yes, we're opening up some Fusion Strike, and I am excited for this. Why? Because of Mew, because of Gengar, because of so many awesome cards in the set. Genesect, of course, Bolton, which I really do love. There's some amazing cards in here. And I can't wait to see if we can pull anything out of this mystery builder of battle pre-release box. I got two of these. I didn't get more than two because they were going like going like gold dust. But I kept one sealed and I'm opening what opening up this one with you guys today. So let's crack this bad boy open. I'm still missing my trusty letter opener, so I'm gonna try and open it this way. There we go. Make sure. Make sure people you have strong teeth, not like me, because make sure you look after your teeth or your teeth will fall out. <laughs> so let's open this up. Now I have no idea what the pre-release card's going to be, so let's hope we get something good. Let's go and put them to the side. And what is the pre-release card? It is... Oh, it's a Latias! Oh wow, that is beautiful right there. Oh, come on, Elias! Pre-release card, that is awesome! So let's go ahead and open that up. I'm very, very happy with that. Was not expecting a Legendary in one of these. Legendaries do sell quite well on the internet, but like I said, there is collectors out there who don't care about any other card but just the Legendaries. Or, of course, the Charizard. But wow, there's our pre-release card, Latias. And it's definitely a preferred Latias than Latios in my eyes. Some of you guys disagree with me. But yeah, that's nice. We have ourselves a quick ball. And then of course you have some quite pricier cards as commons. There's Latios, Latias. Yeah, some great cards. Meloetta, Smurgle. And there's your code. And it's gone. Of course it's gone. So... Let's go ahead and sleeve this beautiful card up. We have four cards, four packs. One we're hoping now, four packs, at least a holographic, maybe a V card, that's all I really want. But literally I've been watching people open these up in other shops, other websites, and they've been, uh, they've been pulling the goods. So here's your code, and it's gone. One, two, three, Four, I think that's the card trick still. Yep, it is. We have ourselves a darkness energy. We got fusion strike energy. We got Turdinator. We got Puki Muku. Volbe. Dupida. Meowth, that's right. We have Onyx. I haven't seen that card in a long time. We got Chutle. We got Exadrill Reverse Foil. And Hey, we get a for alligator hollow. Awesome. Let's nice have a for alligator come back with a holographic. I'll take that. Now, at this moment in time, now people, I would be happy now. These four could be absolutely nothing, but I do not mind. So, here's your code, and it's gone. One, two, three, four. But like I said, people, I feel like my luck is coming back to me. So. We should be fine with it. Nine Tails, Togedemaru, Wulu, we got Gossiflora, Mudkip, Sandshrew, Cuffant, a Reverse Foil Rare Cloister, and a Volk, um, another meme that always is a rare. We got Vicavolt as a standard rare. I don't understand why Pokemon have decided to neglect Vicavolt because Vicavolt was such a great card. It's never got a good holographic card, or a V card, or a V Max. It's just purely neglected. I don't know why. It's a great card. Just do not know why. It's just ridiculous. One, two, three, four. Let's have a looky. We have a Lightning Energy. 
Yeah. Glay score. We got Center Scorch. Bug Catcher. Glay We got Slugma. We got Skitty. We got Flinx, a great card. We got Chutel. Hey, Verizion. Long time no see. Is that a reprint foil? Is that re is that a reprint? I'm sure I've seen that card before, but it's a reverse foil rare. That's nice. Oh, we got Dudrio. Oh, Dudrio is getting a card. All right then. Oh man, it's good to see some OGs getting some loving now and then. That's nice. So Dudrio finally getting a V card. I don't think it ever got a holographic card ever. So that is nice to see that uh, Pokemon is giving some loving to uh, these old school Pokemon from the Kanto region. We got Darkness Energy. We got Persian Power Tablet. We got Darmanitan, Gossiflora, Pampor, Eevee, Tynamo, we have a Galarian Meowth, that's right, we have a not, is that another, nope, that is a Uncommon, we have a Reverse Foil Semipore, oh, and a Swamper as well, Hollow Rare, we got three Hollows out of four packs, that's OMFG right there, that is a fantastic look right there. Some of you lot may disagree, but I definitely do di do agree with it. Before we do say goodbye, people, let's see what we pull today for reverse foils. We've got semi poor and exadrill. Reverse foil rares, we have ourselves the Pharisian and the Cloister. And then for our hollow rares of the day, ladies and gentlemen, of the day, we have our hollow rare Swampert, hollow rare for alligator, the drill V, nice. And our promo, the classic Fusion Strike pre-release card, Latias. If you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you smash the like button, comment down below. And also, like I said, only 9.1% of you lot are subscribed. So what are you lot doing? Come on, subscribe, why don't you? And also, please check out geekretreat.com. They are amazing, and they will love you back. With that being said, the P. Mass Luke will see you guys subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Pre release pack. Very happy with it. A lot better than last month. My god, way better than last month. Woo! I like getting these. These are nice. I don't have a clue what the volumes are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!